So hi guys, uh, I'm just gonna show you what I do when uh, my uh, download speed for uh, Flight Sim 2020 uh, is very slow. So as you see, I just finished downloading my uh, initial download in Steam. It reached 3.9 Mbps. So uh, that was my speed uh, downloading it here. And for my um, speed test, so that we'd know, uh, we'll know uh, what's my uh, internet speed. Let me just run it here in the background. Okay, so again, it reached 3.9 Mbps when I downloaded in Steam. And uh, usually what happens is it's very slow when I download it in uh, uh in the browser i mean in in game if i download the update in game it starts to get it starts to get slow and um i don't even reach the speed so in game if if this will be my speed it will show a 39 point something because this is mbps and then the one there is oh this mega megabytes per second i think and then in game it shows megabits per second I think I'm not sure if I'm doing the or I'm saying the correct term. So here's my current speed. Here, I'll show you here. Oh shit! So here's my speed at thirty-three point forty-one, thirty-three point fifty-two. I see here. It's about April 14, 12, uh, 10 a.m. So this time, so this it's this. I'm just trying not to show my IP here. So yeah, 33, uh, 33, 33 down, 33 up. So we'll check now uh, my speed uh, when I download the update in-game. Okay, so I just opened the flight sim and it's checking the update right now. Let's see if it can, uh, if it can pick up my update fast. I'm just gonna pause uh, the video for a while. I'll be back when the loading stops. Okay, so here's the in-game update. It shows uh, 17.81 gigabyte. So we'll see. I'm gonna put this one here and I'm gonna put my taskbar here because we can actually see the speed of the internet. So here. It says uh, it uh, so currently this is uh, the speed uh, of what I'm getting in my PC okay so let's start the update here this is the correct path I made my own um, uh, official for folder path for the sim so this might be different from what you have so let's click update let's see the speed here Okay, let's let's try to wait for the big uh big files. So here, oh, it's still small. Cause uh the the issue with uh, flight sim, uh with the in game update is that what they do is they download the file, and then after downloading the file, they decompress it. Uh, they decompress what they just uh, downloaded. Uh, what the other game what what other games does is that they, um they download everything first before they decompress it so yeah let's wait for a big file because as you see it, it picks up the file download it and then decompress it so let's see if it's kind of big so let's wait for this one then i will show you what i do which actually gets the actual speed of uh the your internet speed okay let's wait for this to stabilize let's wait for the speed to stabilize so it's still increasing so as you see here i'm getting uh, 4.6 m uh, megabits per second same as this so this should be uh, around uh what, what do i have there 33 right so it should show 33 instead of this so it looks like it's stabilized. So let's try. No, it's it's almost done. Now let's try it now. 
I have this app called the Cloud Cloudflare. Uh, the the one that one that one one that one that one that one uh app. So if I turn this on, it bas it's basically a VPN. So as you see, it's losing speed now because it's trying to reconnect. It's the same here. See, I just cut my internet because it's trying to reconnect to the uh, VPN. So we'll see here that the speed will actually increase. So I was getting uh, 3 point something, right? 3.8, 3.9, right? So look at it now. Ta-da! So you see, it decompressed it. It was so fast that it actually decompressed it so fast. See? Let's wait for another big file. See? I was getting 3.8, 3.9 earlier. Now I'm getting this speed. See here? My receive speed is getting faster too. Uh, so what happens here is that in the Philippines, we have a PLDT and then they, uh, they have a Signat. Uh, I think CG NAT uh, connection. So we're basically sharing with other people in one huge, uh, maybe, I don't know, router in their site. I'm not sure how the technology works, but it's basically a big router that is shared to everyone uh, in one specific area, something like that. So what they do is they, uh, I think they limit the speed on a different... Uh, uh, different uh, areas or countries so for example for this one I think the servers for uh, flight sim is in Asobo studios and I think it's in the Netherlands so when I turn on the uh, VPN uh, it skips or somewhat skips the PLDT uh, the the limiting part of the PLDT th stuff so so since it skips it, I, I, I'm actually not sure how the technology works, but that's what I think. It just skips our ISP so that it removes the limitation. So, or, or basically since our ISP limits uh, the internet speed when downloading stuff from servers, um, it basically skips that when I turn on my VPN. So this is a free VPN, actually. It's a VPN, I think. It's uh, called the one that one that one. I'll show it to you now while this is updating. Wait. Uh, here. It's a simple one that one one. See. Google search. Just download this app. So I just downloaded this one, Windows, and it got installed. And it's free. I don't have. I don't even have to register. So. So see the difference if I turn it on and then if I, if you want I'll turn it off so just to show you. Let's wait for a big file so that we can compare. This one's this one looks big. So let's wait for it to stabilize. So it's thirteen, still increasing. Fourteen. Nope. That's it. So it stays in uh, thirteen, right? So I'm gonna turn off the VPN and let's see how much my speed is now. So remember it was 13, right? So it's slowly, it's getting slow and then it cuts off. And then once it cuts off, it will reconnect. It will say, please wait and then it will rec reconnect. And it will go back to maybe slower than 3.8, I think. The first thing we got was 3.8, right? So let's see. Increasing, still increasing. Okay, we're all already in three. Let's see. But you can already see the difference that it doesn't go up as fast as when it's on. So I see that it's stuck in 3.8 now. Okay, so I'm gonna turn it on again. And we'll see the difference again. Let's see. So it cuts off. 
Internet cuts off. And it will reconnect again. So let's see how fast it is now. See? It's already three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then here, look at my speed. It's now 24, 21. So, yeah. So basically, that's what I do to get out of the uh, slow internet speed when downloading updates. I know it's not the speed that I actually get with my, uh, it's not actually my uh, internet speed, actual internet speed, but it's better than the slow one. So see, it's already in 22. So yeah, that's basically it. And uh, if you like the video, if, uh, if it helped you, um, uh, please consider to subscribe, like uh, the video and share it to your friends and uh, let me know if it worked uh by commenting down below and i really hope that it helped you because i don't know there's something wrong with isps that limits internet speed eh, well we understand why so yeah that's it thank you so much for watching and bye